So in this video, we're going to talk about issues with your computer freezing. Now, if you're having issues because your computer keeps freezing, I'm going to give you some ideas as to why it might be happening and how you can hopefully easily resolve those problems. Now, some of the most common reasons um, that your computer would keep freezing would be due to out-of-date drivers on your computer. Um, maybe there's issues related to computer memory. There could be a software conflict or files conflicting on your uh, computer. Your computer may be overheating. Uh, could be due to spyware or malware due to viruses, trojans. And uh, very rarely, it may also be due to a damaged hard drive. And so what I want to show you, there are software products out there that can resolve this issue for you and they can go out there and scan for a lot of the issues on your computer to try to resolve them. But the problem is, until I found this software here, I couldn't find one that had all of them together into one that would check pretty much all the major common errors that a computer would keep freezing and uh, and would automatically fix them. And that's what I want to show you with this software. And you can download it. Um, from this website here. It's called PC Health Advisor and the website is pchadvisor.com and you can see here that they are a Microsoft partner. They are a partner also of Intel and accredited Better Business Bureau. So this isn't one of those uh, cheap knockoff software tools that uh, you're going to find some individual made just to make some money off of you but this is some this is some pretty good software that I've been using for a long time and it does a fantastic job and you can see here some of the things that it does is it optimizes speed and performance you can update your drivers it has increased security by uh, removing malware um, access to great tools and I'm, I want to go over and show you some of the stuff that it can do right now just to give you a better idea of what it is if you decide that you want to uh, invest in it like I said you can download it for free and it will scan your computer and show you all the issues that's wrong with it all the drivers that need updated but if you want to take action upon those you would have to purchase it and as far as I know right now it's ten dollars off and you can buy the whole thing for like twenty nine dollars and when I was checking the other day for a new software tool just to check for uh, drivers uh, my outdated drivers on my computer it cost me thirty dollars alone just for a tool to do that so so this is pretty impressive to have all these tools combined into one software where you can easily access all of them and check for issues with your computer and why your computer would keep freezing for so first thing that I want to do is when you install the software you want to uh, click to scan it and what it's going to do is it's going to scan through all of your registry files and it's going to find errors and you can see right here it's finding a bunch of them and these were um, a lot of things that I had downloaded recently just to see if it would find them this here you can see coupons.com it's, it's a coupon bar it's one of those uh, kind of adware type things and it looks like it found um, a lot of the files that came along with that along with many other programs I had installed and uninstalled on my computer and so what I'm going to do I'm going to pause this video while it runs through this and I will resume it here in just a second okay it only took about 30 seconds and now it's moving on to the second step with the, which is the process and you can see here how it's scanning for different items and now it's going through my internet history and uh, a lot of the other things and you can see here the problems that it found and I can easily fix all these issues just by clicking fix all and a lot of these issues will help to speed up my computer and especially if you're having issues that your computer keeps freezing this will definitely help that out um, and it may even completely solve your problem um, here's a lot of the registry problems that I had and um, this doesn't surprise me that I do have a lot because I've been installing and uninstalling a lot of software lately which does cause a lot of issues with uh, registry files not uh, linking up correctly with other files or missing files um, and then there's no malware any issues with optimizing performance because I pretty much keep my computer up to date and then startup processes this is really neat here for your startup processes this um, this will help you speed up the overall time that it takes for your computer to boot up and it will allow you to actually go in and stop a lot of the uh, tools that load as soon as you start your computer up and by doing that it will tremendously speed up the speed or speed up the process of your computer booting up and so it found 238 items and I can click fix all and it's going to go through and it's going to clean and fix all these problems so I'm going to pause the video again and I'll resume it in just a second okay and it just finished and it asked me if I wanted to reboot my computer and I said not just yet 
Um, so the next thing that I want to do is I want to check my drivers because now that I've I've taken care of all of my all of the um, issues with my files and software and everything in the computer now I want to check for my drivers and see if they're updated because this here like I said is one of the biggest reasons that you're going to have um, computer your computer is going to be uh, freezing uh, crashing uh, just all kinds of stuff out outdated drivers can cause a lot of problems and so just by clicking on driver manager it's going to automatically uh, start scanning for all the drivers on my computer and it's going to show me the ones that are outdated and just like that I have seven of them that are outdated which is quite surprising actually I didn't think I had uh, that many but you can see here I have uh, my USB um, ports I guess on my motherboard uh, those drivers need updated my sound video cards this is my audio card needs updated my video card and I'm not sure what this is but they're saying it needs updated too and so this here can cause a lot of problems with my computer and by simply clicking download it's going to allow me to download the correct files to update those drivers whereas if you don't have a driver manager like this here you have to go out and search for those files yourself which they may be provided by your manufacturers uh, website but it's just kind of a pain to go out there and search and find all those and so they're all neatly organized here and found you just click uh, you just simply go over here and click download and you can install them and now there's a lot of other things on here I'm not going to go through everything because I've, sh I've showed you guys the basics of the software and and how it can definitely improve or even uh, totally solve your issue with your computer freezing um, but this does so much more. This is there are so many tools with this. Um, you know, it's got the device driver to update the drivers. It's got a registry cleaner, a file extension software database. Um, it has built-in tools to remove spyware and malware uh, processes that are running in the memory. It it gives you the option to remove privacy files, um, which which will help you to keep your logins, passwords, banking, and credit card information safe. Um, and if we go down here, just a few other tools they have built in. The, the defrag, this here is, is going to be found in your computer. You're going to have this uh, tool available on your computer. This is just an easy way to access it and to use it. And it's a little bit more graphical friendly. Um, let's go to disk here. You can set up restore points. Here you can easily clear, clear your temporary files or your recent history. You can find duplicate files on your computer. And then there's additional settings here, and this is neat because it'll allow you to adjust your home page settings. Um, how these are set up right here, these six options, you can change them by whatever you use the most by just simply dropping and dragging them into uh, the six boxes up here. And so that's that's pretty much the, the 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 software. And like I said, I do highly recommend it. Now, before you do go out and buy it and say, oh, you know, this guy works for the company, yada yada, he's trying to sell it. Well, I don't work for this company. Um, I just use a lot of their products, and I and I really like them. And like I said, it's just not some individual who made a cheap product trying to sell it, but it it is a very reliable and reputable company. And and their software is very affordable too. Like I said, this one here currently, it normally runs. I'm thinking thirty nine dollars, and they normally offer like a ten dollar off coupon which was available the last time I checked so you can get it for just 29 bucks which in my opinion is a great deal with all the tools you get with it and so like I said if you do want to check it out the links there on your page it is also underneath the video in the description you can just click on it there it'll take you straight to this page just click the green download button and it'll take you to um, where you can download the software and do some free scans on your computer to see um, you know how bad your computer is and um, and from there you can choose whether you decide you know if you want to invest in it or not so I hope that helps you out and have a great day